spectator, Stuart Broad. Wonderful to be back and wonderful to see Mark Wood. First T20 for England for quite some time from experience there. <laughs> to the Pakistan captain, dispatched to the bound. Field. I mean. Yeah, Mark Wood puts us in. See if that swing is still there. He's runs away pretty nicely. Such a good cricket pitch. Pace bowlers love it. Particularly hitting square with the oval. If you just beat the infield there, just with cover, you don't need to run for those. They all went our way because he's, he's hit the four or out. Crucially, you can't afford to do it. The oval is give width. Or with it, no fielders up there. Side back to back boundaries. Arborism was under pressure. We were talking at the start of the side back boundary. I think Chris Jordan will be frustrated with himself. There is that. That's how you do it. Just dances down, gets to the pitch, makes it full, and maybe he just loses balance slightly whereas Abra's outside the circle <laughs> he went down down on both knees but he can't stop it <laughs> 47 without loss by England's Joss Butler in aggressive box not to get with in the deep Phil Salted is excellent work. The athleticism to dive, controlling. Uh, came off very quickly of the across the turf and gets down in time. Gets looks offside again. It's Salt. There's it two more, and that brings up the easy conditions to start with. Off the surface. Oh, a smile from Archer. Really a pre. Offside and harder, can yeah, Just on the chop and in an aim to dominate as well, just shimmy down the track. Team. One of the best in the business, that gap, and pick up a boundary. Through the offside, and skipper, disappointment for Archer. Again, it's again short, wide, and the clock. Pace off and straight, and Archer is the man. To make the break. You're very fine when you're bowling to the class of barbarism. Roll this finger over as well. Pace off. And in England wanted. It is the Pakistan skipper. Once again, into the wickets. First one. Yeah. Yeah, bowl variation. This is a leg spinner that does it. The offside, it just skids on through the gate. Which Rashid does so well. Fuck as a man, number four. In terms of clarity of role. In the air. And all the way for Siv from ball one. Seeing it here. I like the spin, but it is short. It is a half fall and it is there to. I cut away. We just looped off the bat. Adil Rashid probably thought it was coming to him. That's not him. He's a natural nominal numbers up the order. But now that they've got him in at four, and I think now with Gary Kirst and Azar Mahmood seem to be on the same. Down the wicket and swatted to the leg side in Birmingham. Yet again, prove a long ball. Very good down the track. Always will stay legs one after the other. Fakhar Zaman, but I just feel slightly pull the length back as well. Big opportunity, 45. Takes a time. Quite windy here today. Hit this one out of the park. Only distance on it at all. Adil Rashid had plenty of good catch. Not easy when they are that high up in the air. Yeah, real miss stumping, followed by a brilliant hit the ball. He was impressive. Comms change of 
the end of this over. And a leg spinner just goes on with the arm clip Adil Rashid will take without a contribution Pakistan 84 for four fifty-nine off the power play I just walked in, there was never a single on, and he's like a run out. Oh, Adil producing deliveries with almost a slider. Oh, it's between franchise cricket and international cricket. Adil is the top spinner this time. Done is done is difficult. Googly to finish. 84 for four, Pakistan. They started nicely. <laughs> A lot about that. That was just reaction. I think this is good captaincy, bringing back Mark Wood, genuine penny to any you could be struggling to set a good score. It's the leg side. And he is going in short and has been wide. It has done extremely well to keep the player of the Keir Oval. And he'd gone onto the practice pitch and... <laughs> Wee, that's flown through and hit him. Well, Azam is trying to suggest to his... Furl, I think he's walking off, so he has got... Out the shoulders if to try and kid the umpire, but the glove. It's great bowling. I'm sure the bat... 86 for five, Azam goes for naught. Knock from Azam Khan. He couldn't really pick out it. Brilliant from Wood, though. Beautifully angled it. But it's always there with Mark Wood. If you get wide, you can get you can get sort of uppercut up. getting like this off a off a wet surface, as we saw with that last wicket. But at the moment, Pakistan just need us. <laughs> if the car is away, and that's raced down to that short. Mark Wood doing exactly what skipper Josh Butler would have wanted. The leg spin of Adil Rashid at the other end. But on almost not caring if he goes for runs in this over, just get us a break. Yeah, I think that's the point. It was absolutely at the unintended strategic timeout. Oh, and start straight away. His accuracy. Whoa, it's something aggressive, but he decides to just turn it into is the most important thing. He's bold blip times as well so he's been if the car Mark Wood will keep it to a single turf if you can the field heaved away down the ground as he got enough of it well to be able to punish that over long off follow through Strongly hit, does it carry? No. Line of the batsman has Liam Livingston. You say, and I completely agree with you, if they're targeting this over to try and... Back for two, and he has. Yeah, I think Livingston's bowling, and with Mary Nally just being a hint... Boundary of the last ball. 14 for 5. Wickets left. Or do we try and take on bowlers? Now ultimately, if Pakistan lose another wicket now. Well, that's the thing, isn't it? You've got to get some. And you're right. 
you know, really trying to go high. It was a good over from Livingston, and it's now going to be Chris. Five balls of the innings. Archer has two, Wood one from Adil Rashid. Way for four, flashes away. A hint of width, and Usman has taken it. It's that deep in the crease, knowing that with into that area, you get great value, firstly, because you, you find it very difficult to defend against. Leg side brings a change in the field. Ar Rashid to backward point. Yeah. That was a very good strike with the ball. You do feel Usman a strike in those last four or five overs. Great, but it's being used to the full at the moment, region after they went back to their original field. Jordan had a third man the ball before, but he's looking to bowl the off. Don't want width. Unfortunately, he just offered that get a boundary. Gus, any field changes? Can't spot any at the minute. So he's probably run up to Chris Jordan and just said, really. Yeah, can't quite work out this way. It's like the Chris Jordan practicing something for the World Cup. He's certainly bowling wide, and that's been thundered. 126 for five. Sink. Yeah, that can happen. Can lose quickly. So, yeah, I mean, rhythm is an interesting word in bowling because of the crease. And the difficult bowling conditions these when you've got the footholds you get a bit of wind out there and so uh, yeah you, you... are they going to target Livingston Chris Jordan Livingston over if it carries he'll get sprinting in full tilt ball dip right into both hands this is fabulous catching you get and he's as good as you get one of the best in the in the long on Get a lot of catches in that position. 38, 1, 2, 6 for 6. Fallen, trying to take down Livingston like you were suggesting, but he's hit it in the vicinity of Chris Jordan. It was the right call from the batting side. Take down the target this over and try and take... You're in trouble because Chris Jordan is superb. But you're now exposing the likes of Shaheen. So it's round the wicket now, you'd think... Shaheen. Livingston has another one. Slightly ugly shot <laughs> of Liam Livingston just skids on to the top. A few times in your career, actually. Yes, more than once. Sometimes. He walked off for naught before. <laughs> yes. Well, Shaheen Sharafridi's stay he now comes out to join Iftikhar, who's got to farm the strike. He saw it differently, he thought he could take. But England are, are in tight. Wood likewise at mid wicket. And it is a double. Bowlers and in the field. It's wet, slippery, cold. Not sure Butler is going to collapse seven. And it won't get any easier. Good pace, good carries. If the car innings. Yeah, well, isn't it? With Nazim coming in nine, he can obviously bat. And down the order, they can bat a bit. Shots or careless. First game to Ireland. A lot of talk about Pakistan not going home. Imminent is that if you've committed to me new and recently being coach, needs to build that trust. For particularly dump to aim at. Yeah, it was Adil Rashid at backward point. Rashid. Just the one stump off balance. Oh. He's a still an over to bowl. 
couple of catches. Evan. The way for England. Five of the seven wickets have fallen to the. Ting towards the pod. Long off. With this would be the way to go. Yeah, good away. Nassim Shah. If the go. Actually, have more, but he's purposely bowled a lot of sliders. Three is going to be dispatched into the members. Oh. Rashid's done 143 for seven. To turn to Sadil Rashid. That seems it's full reward down the ground. The best ball he's bowled today, Adil Rashid. Well, he had come down the wicket a couple well, of times in the same over. Over. I'm sure if he had his eyes open there. <laughs> This is a good contest this evening. Not sure he'll do that. He may with this field action. Of an innings, excellent. Yes. Yeah. It's gone. Along says mine. It should be taken. Battle of the finishers is won by Jordan the bowler. Splice of the bat. Butler says wasn't going to do it again. The 16, 149 for nine. Running excellent execution, even better. Very, very. Livingston, the man again down there. With the pace of our. Pretty hard. Hit. They've got six so far with three deliveries. Deep in the crease. Still at... That's a very, very... A definite change of plan for England. Compare slot. There, no. Can Ralph get back? No. Ball and in the field. Pakistan have been... In the field and with the ball. Person in the background have their work cut out. half of this game this final game in this format Rouge, i don't i don't think so just get stand have it's going to be a challenge conditions were very similar walls and bounce on the wicket and the score was very very he actually went down injured back in all the way through that game the they call results. him the eagle and they will show the first few deliveries until the ball was hit into the world game that can extract any bit of swing one up in the series Pakistan will walk to left yeah I think that's the key there are 158 from their set of with the one slip full targeting the stumps you would imagine 100 Phil Salt, who's been a magnificent form. Number one, number one, number one, number one, number one. Point, obviously. Just shy away. Control. Boundary none. But he is wide at one and a half. Rizwan. First boundary and a bit of luck for England. Flicked off the legs. Just a while back where... Just pulled the length back. <laughs> A dive in brilliant athleticism from the fast bowler rockets from him earlier on as we saw from his first game in this series a couple of changes in some way for salt the welcome boundary but for swing salt looking was in the slot. No, 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 no. There. 
Oh, why it was so nice and crisp. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, score. It's one thing I really like about this excellent bowling side. Neither of them back down. That is swiped into the slightly Naseem Shah, and now he's been hit for two boundaries. Both the covers. This is just a flip. Conscious that man out of deep square is. Now very quick to adapt, even in the shorter. The over England 18 for no loss. The lineup today, no reason top. No, no, no. The strongest suit as, as well. Hardest row with spoke to Barbara at the toss, him along with <laughs> tucked away into the leg side again. Ruby, which will come back into you as well. A little bit, of and for me, you look at Shaheen's strength, <laughs> leading edge. There wasn't a lot of swing when England were bowling. Probably there, still glimpsed the other day you know, where he acts as pretty much. <laughs> this time, as a very straight line. That is good. The start, the rouge. Start their account with a boundary. On the angle, good pace to work with. A lot of runs are scored. I'll just add more try. It was into the surface. Opposing a shot is this. Good length ball, top of the stumps, picks up. The offside. Another crisply times. This is excellent batting from Phil. First through the leg side. And to get it through the offside. It's almost like Pakistan is an erring on both sides. The field was set for... That is a some hit. Salt is now having some fun out there. Moves to 29 from just the inside. Half of the bat with a slow... That's it. Full-blooded scoop, but actually swung towards... Salt yet again, the aggressor. He heard that. Butler, the aggressor now. Order from Butler. And the crowd are down the wicket. Very rarely see this. More so against the. Crunches that to 63 of 29. Yeah, comeback ball not great. Tries to jam in the off room. And with the offside up. It is short, it is into the surface over as well. All of the over. It was pulled into the legs and team. <laughs> In England at the moment, thing has been brilliant, but the think tank of Pucket with a new ball, it's gonna go square. Edge of the circle, goes through, put down, was there an edge? Good heat, we saw that from Wood earlier in the evening. Push it past the post, that's all he could do. And your side are under so much pressure. You get that opportunity and a fairly... Another four. It's a welcome along to Ben Dunn. Oh yes. Oh no. Great stands. And Pakistan have their breakthrough, they have been in the pod. These two are going to have the extra fielder out there. Boy, did Pakistan need that. Just 24. England, 82 for one. Actually, sometimes does that. Um, I'd be time and time again, so I'm sure I'll have a look at a couple. Well, Pakistan have got the breakthrough and they need another Ooh. leg. Jack is he's going to have a look. <laughs> he had a look in his... ...ground well and he has seen them well. On the, the sound off the bat was as crisp as you like. She bluff and go against some of their plans, like some of their field. Sorry, you don't even need to react to the ball. Um, now he watched to the square leg boundary. Astonishing. 
Now the scoop, no, missed it. She obviously not in the starting eleven and weren't in the starting. Like hand off the pitch, um, you know, and if that. God, oh, no. Absolutely simple. Azam Khan, regulation chance, regulation. And then he gave him a buzzer as well when he threw it. Well, that's gone away for four. Wait, four runs. 100 comes up, 101. Edge, caught one. Azim Khan is not. And he kept banging away at that length. Rizwan really did fall apart. Slower ball, and that is ups. Back. And the IPL again holds his shape. Bolding! What a comeback today! Hard length. Slash your delivery. 90 mile an hour, Yorker. It's a better Yorker. That'll get rid of him. And that is a superb ball. Almost like there was a bit of frustration in that. Bears throw into the action. Draw boundary. Fired away. Over X. Well, yet again. Or yet again. Brett throughout the whole of that Ashes camp. Looks to have wintered well, too. Guy on the ball. Delight. Needs something to happen. It's no good. Not bowling him. By Harry Brook and will race back. Another broad. Stewart. About 20 years at the ICC. It's his love. For three. Pull away from Bairstow. Looks in great form this evening. Deep in his crease. And he looking for that short out of the middle of that bat. Just above stump height. Oh, clever. Really side with pace on. Pace off. Yeah, moves on to 26 off just 13. <laughs> Pass back for point. Will it? Up and over. I said they may try and.